to His Excellency, the God of Israel, even the Lord Elijah, to Her Majesty the Queen, Queen Luluova, to the royal family, priesthood, to the entire house of the Israelites, say Shalom. Shalom. Shalom means peace be unto you. We want to once again do the House of Israel Bible class, which is a class that always educates you, gives you the knowledge, wisdom, and understanding that is needed. And it is Black History Month, and we want to talk some of it. We want to see in this Black History Month where have we gone wrong? The word history means a fountain of knowledge that looks at past events, present events. History also talks about a systematic narrative of the past event relating to a particular people. We want to show how important it is And why the black race is in such a state? The reason we are called lost sheep is because we have lost something. When we begin to go into this study, we will begin to see what we've lost is so valuable that it means everything to us. Tell you the Bible asks a question. We're going to look at it. We want to talk about black history, but we want to look at this scripture. The book of Jeremiah. Jeremiah 2. And 11. To 13. Black history we're talking about. Have the nation changed their gods? We, we, we want to look at this. Look at something that is so important. Listen to what the scripture said. Read it for me again. Have the nation changed their gods? It says, have a nation change their god. You, you. <laughs> You know, you know you can change almost anything. How about once a people change their God? They have lost everything. Read it again, what it says. Had a nation changed their God? Had a nation! You, 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 you know your God. Is your strength. Your God is your fortress. Something that you hold on to in the time of trouble. 
in the same Jeremiah 16 and verse 19. Let us look there. Jeremiah 16, verse 19. Listen to what it says, yes? What it says? Oh Lord. Oh Lord! My strength and my, my strength. You, 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 you know what it is saying? The God that wants we accept God. He becomes our strength. Let, let, me, let me tell you something. Once the people work together with God, oh, there's no mountain that they cannot climb. I don't know if you're hearing me. Listen, listen to what God was to us. This is what he got to be. Listen to what he said. Read it again. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. My strength and my fortress. God is our strength. Amen. And our fortress. Yes. And my refuge. You, 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 you know, let me tell you this. The pressure is coming down so much that we need a refuge. Pressure. You know why? Because we haven't got a refuge. A hiding place. I tell you it's sad, but it's true. Look at it. The Chinese come here. When something is wrong, they go to the Chinese Association. The Indians! Oh, they got so many places that they can go. But our people, is somewhere you hide when it's trouble. Someone that protects you. What it says? Oh Lord, my strength. Oh Lord, God, God to be your strength. And my lip and my fortress. Yes? Yes, what it says. Read on. The Gentiles shall come unto thee. You, 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 you know, you know, let's listen to what God is saying. We try to adapt to everybody's culture. Everybody culture. 
Sometimes we don't love our own selves. That we want to become white. You know, you know it's the churches we learn that. They tell us to sing, wash me and make me white to that snow. Said the Gentiles shall come unto the earth. Shall come unto thee from the ends of the earth. How are they coming from everywhere? You, 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 you got to stay with your culture. Stay with Israel. Stay with Elijah. He said, the Gentiles gonna come. Mm -hmm. you, you know what the master said? He said, when the Bible said, the Gentile shall come, you know what he said? It must happen. Mm -hmm. Oh, and nothing can stop it. Said a Gentile shall come unto thee from all the ends of the earth, yes? And shall say. And they're going to say it! Surely. Oh, surely! Our fathers have inherited life. You, you know what they say? They say that they teach us. Set this people. 
people. Yes. People. Yes. Rob and spoil. We rob. <laughs> you know, I was looking up the word rob. You know what it means? To take something from someone. Willfully! Who oh, it said without their permission. It said to damage them to the extreme. Said but this people, yes. Rob and spoil. We robbed. <laughs> you know, you know we really robbed. Listen to what God said. He said, you will be the head and not the tail. Today when we look at ourselves, every nation used us as a ladder to make them become rich. He said, but this people, yes? Deliver this people. 
Repeat, but... Yes? For a spoil. For a spoil! And then said, restore. I tell you, nobody ain't crying out to God to restore us. Oh, in this Black History Month, this is what we can look at. How to become attached to our Savior. This, this, this is what makes sense in Black History Month. That when we begin to hold on to our strength, which is Elijah, our fortress and our refuge, once again, black people can able to see the light. This is what I want to leave with you. This time until the next time, May the Lord Elijah bless and keep you. This is my prayer.